How was the fishing? Oh, sí, ¿Qué cogieron? Sí. Enseña algo, bro. Dale, vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Let's see, let's see. What? Wow. What? They killed it, bro. What? Look at that. That is crazy. Oh, hey, you killed it. Killed it. Wow, guys. That is a good day fishing. Thank you. From the trees to the keys, I like that. You know, you know, there's a guy. Am I wrong, dog? Hey, I'm going from the keys to the trees. I'm doing backwards. Está bueno, está bueno día. Yeah, it's a good day, bro. Oye, está bonito, Grady White S. Eh? Beautiful, beautiful boat. Hey, that thing will go through haul over like nothing. Very nice. You guys gonna go fishing now? Good luck, man. Hey, they said there's mahi 1,600 to 2,000 feet. Yeah. Yeah. But do some snapper fishing. There's snapper fishing at night. Good. How was the day? Did you guys do good? Good. You caught? Yeah. What did you catch? All right, well, glad to see you guys had a good time then. Ahí no me la tomado. Chicho en dos. For sale. It's for sale. for sale. How much? Put the comments. Put it in my comment section. <laughs> Damn. Oh my goodness. No para esto, bro. Esto no para. Esto no para. I throw one boat after another, Chicho. Oh man, what a cool video. What a cool video. You know what sucks? The YouTube does not push those videos. Like right now, look, this right here is a Chicho. They'll push this, right? That's a pull of faith hug. Thank you, thank you, gracias. I can go home now. Thank you. Me está muriendo de hambre. Ya, ya, gracias. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you. Me voy. Te doy el cheque mañana en el correo. En el correo. Te lo mando por Cash App. No, no. Sigo. Seguimos. Seguimos. Espéralo. Le voy a meter ahí, dale, acuérdate. Ahora es cuando se pone esto bueno. She say, métele, métele, give him hell, give him hell. They know, they know, guys. They know, they know. It's all about love, guys. But they got it. They got it. They got it. This is, this is, this is the, the energy I feed off of, guys. Off of your positive energy, you guys just throw and uh it just fills me man don't worry i got you bro i got you we're not live anymore we're not live it's okay bro you can take a deep breath just chill if you get if you stay in the if you stay in ayer uno por la noche por la madrugada a la once a la once No joda. Oh no, we got Barcelo music in the background, guys. Anything but this. Oh, we're gonna have to end the clip right here. No, 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 we'll edit it, we'll edit it. Don't worry about it, don't worry about it. Ah, uh, maybe this is underground music. I don't know, maybe, what do you think? Maybe, possible? 
possible underground music. Oh boy. They are coming in. We got some heat in the house. Well, guys, the Chicho is making a scene. <laughs> Oye, cierra los ojos, bro. Tú eres un hombre casado. Yo estoy trabajando. In the house. Thank you, guys. Mucho, mucho amor, bro. Thank you, guys. Hey, Alfred Montaner, I am out of here, guys. Hey, we're gonna end. We're gonna end it there, guys. Stay positive. Stay true to yourself. Stay blessed. Alfred Montaner making a scene as always. Black Point Marina. I am out of here. Pursuit coming in. No, oh no! It's gonna get some, hurry up, hurry up! Fix it! Oh boy! Oh boy, that little Yamaha almost got some. That Yamaha almost got a little breakfast. A little breakfast uh, love tap. Boop, boop. Wow. Welcome to the Chit Show, my friends. My name is Alfred Montanier, and yeah, that is. Um, the beginning of our video today at Black Point Marina. How interesting. I am wearing a shirt the same color as this bikini. How crazy is that? It's a sign from God. All right, guys. Oh, let's go ahead and uh, begin the chicho. I already uh, seen some of it. Not all of it, but uh, I don't know. All I'm going to say is wait for it. And Fred is acting crazy. It's so, so crazy. So much so like this damn sawgrass that's making a scene all over the boat ramp, guys. It's, it's like literally like mountains of it. Pursuit coming in. No, oh no! It's gonna get some, hurry up, hurry up! Fix it! Oh boy! Oh boy, that little Yamaha almost got some. That Yamaha almost got a little breakfast. A little breakfast uh, love tap. Boop, boop. Wow. Welcome to the Chit Show, my friends. My name is Alfred Montanier, and yeah, that is. Um, the beginning of our video today at Black Point Marina. How interesting. I am wearing a shirt the same color as this bikini. How crazy is that? It's a sign from God. All right, guys. Oh, let's go ahead and uh, begin the chicho. I already uh, seen some of it. Not all of it, but uh, I don't know. All I'm going to say is wait for it. And Fred is acting crazy. It's so, so crazy. So much so like this damn sawgrass that's making a scene all over the boat ramp, guys. It's, it's like literally like mountains of it. Hey, let me know if you guys see the baby croc. Uh, hopefully not. He's there. No, he's over there. I saw him this morning. 100%. He went this way in the morning. The little one, not the big one. But the little one is still as big as your boat. Oh, you guys are in a see-through boat? Oh, dude. Hey, if you don't make it, I got your own film. Oh, my God. Guys, look at my Instagram. Look at my Instagram. I was filming. He was there. 
oh man, one day I'm, I'm telling you what's gonna happen. I'm gonna have to come out of this damn uh, marina in a kayak. And, uh, and Fred's gonna get me, guys. I got a feeling, that's just my fate. I, you know how I say wait for it? I'm just gonna tell you, wait for it. It's gonna happen. Oh no, dude, we just started, bro. Why do we have Marcelo music so early, bro? So yeah, um, I did, I really did see it. And I, I try to tell people, you, you, you guys see me playing around, but if I tell you, yeah, I saw the croc. I, I saw the croc. I'm not gonna go ahead and just say I didn't see the croc. So, and I can back it up with footage, right? Ah, <sighs> yeah, and the see-through, imagine. <laughs> the croc is right below you, can you imagine? Can you imagine that? You're in a see-through boat, a little see-through kayak, and the croc is right under you saying hello. That'll be wild. I would love to, to, to get that footage. Mm -hmm. Let's see when, when they come back what they say. Look, guys, whatever, you know what I say, whatever it takes, right? This is one of those whatever it takes moments. A little six horsepower, that's all you need to be out on the water. Oh boy, what is going on here? Your lines, your lines, your lines, your lines, your lines, my friend, your lines. You know, your lines, gotta bring your lines in. Oh boy. We need mosquito control and this is the perfect time in the morning to be mosquito control, guys. This is the time. Yes, we need it. Bring it over here, guys. Make make sure it comes over here because these no seams are on fire. Now the question is this: later in the day, who will be the hero of all heroes at the boat ramp, my friends? I don't know. If I had that answer all the time, I'd be a very wealthy person. Ooh. Look, 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 just so you guys see what's going on. What? All right, my bad. Sorry about that, guys. I know. So you see this grass? Look how it's flowing. Okay, so this is flowing. For, oh, look, 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 they have to get it all out. So this is flowing from the dam. There's a dam on the up, uh, opposite side to the right, right? Where I, if I point the camera to the right, you go further ahead, there's a dam that doesn't let you go any further and it goes into our canal system over here that leads through Cutler Bay. One day I'll kind of do a video there. There you might see alligators in that water system. Now here, since we're in kind of brackish water, we can see crocs. Dude, this guy's losing a lot of water in there. There's, there's, there's a lot of water coming out of that boat. Does this guy realize that he maybe didn't put his drain plug? Wow, that is a problem, guys. Oh boy. <laughs> Can you imagine you gotta come to the boat ramp and you gotta... <laughs> that is wild. I can't believe that. That's when you know your day is gonna suck. When you start off a morning like this and you literally gotta clean the boat ramp, How wild would it be if Fred the Croc is right there? Look, look, the, the captain just said, F it, bro, just let's go. We'll, we'll clean it out of here because it's coming right at us. Oh boy, Freedom Boat Club, don't worry about it, guys. I won't tell anybody. Don't worry about it, I won't tell anybody. Stop, I'm not gonna tell anybody. We're not even starting the morning, bro. Oh boy, there goes a little love tap. There we go, there we go. In the morning this happens as well, bro? All right guys, back to cleaning the boat ramp. We gotta clean the water. We got shot killed by a big boy. Uh-oh, we got some big boys coming on here. Get off my lawn, guys, get off my lawn. All right, all right, wait for it. Um, tap in the forward. Hall of Faith push off. Uh-oh, did you see that? This guy's special, bro. He actually touched the ground floor. Normally, the Pope is the only one that and he kisses it, but this guy must be real. Dude, there's a lot of water still coming out of that boat, bro. Let me tell these guys something, bro, because look at all the water that's coming. 
Oye, ¿ustedes pusieron el tapón? ¿Ustedes pusieron el tapón? Oye. Bro, there's too much water coming out of that boat. Jefe, ¿ustedes pusieron el tapón? Did you guys put the plug? Del bote. Yeah. There's a lot of water coming out of that boat. That's why I'm telling you that. A lot of weed in there. Yeah, I know, but there's a lot of water coming from your bilge. A lot of weed in there. All right. Just want to try to make sure you guys are okay. All the rain last night. All right. Bloop, bloop. Bloop, 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 bloop. Don't say I didn't call it, guys. Wow. It stopped. It stopped? Rain. I uh, think it's all that rain. All right. I just want to make sure you guys are good, man. Yeah, that's a lot of water, guys. That's a lot of water. The early morning edition, my friends. Over here, Alfred Montaner scratching himself like a crackhead. Yeah, there was, there was, there, there was a lot of rain yesterday. But normally, guys, here's what I, I would recommend, right? When you, when you have your boat at home, you take off your drain plug. And if it rains, it automatically drains itself. So you don't have to deal with that, all right? What a, an amazing concept, right? Wow. I am literally making the world better. All right, all right, so look, as long as this seagrass doesn't come up here and Fred doesn't just surprise me randomly, I am good. For now, we will continue the Chicho early morning edition and uh, I don't know, we're gonna, have a, we're gonna have a long day, it's gonna be a great day. If you haven't seen a lot of my other Chicho videos, guys, and you just stumbled across my channel, my name is Alfred Monter, I'm host of the Chicho and also known as the King of Hallover. It's, I mean, I, it's incredible how many titles I give myself. Um, and, uh, and then you guys support me. So I'm like, hey, listen, I'm just gonna give myself titles and you guys support me and I'm, pfft. before you know it, I'll be president of the United States. Uh, it's gonna happen at one point, you know? I mean, I'll never show up to work, but I'll still be at the boat ramp, claiming I'm the president. What do we have here, my friends? It's nice. You see how nice and serene things are over here at the boat ramp? You could just chill. You watch a bloop, bloop, bloop happen. We got some working out going on. Who needs a peloton nowadays? You just go to the boat ramp, you pull your boat, come in and out. This is why peloton's gonna go out of business. And this is why we lose the pull of faith. See the angle that that guy has on the boat? This mother effer, bro. He just did it to me. He just did it to me, guys. He just creeped up on me. Look at him, look at him. He just creeped up on me. Oh my God, wow, wow. He just creeped up on me, bro. Holy smack. Hold on, hold on. All right, guys, hold on a second. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at my phone. He just, and he's camouflaged. Hold on, guys, hold on. I'm gonna film with my phone. What, a, what a monster. What a monster. Another one bites the dust, dun, dun. Another one, and another one, and another one bites the dust, dun, dun. <laughs> The sawgrass for the wind, my friends. It's gonna, it's, it's, uh... That's over three. Oh my goodness, really? They just got here? Oh boy. No, no, what happened, my friends? Oh no, the captain?
What happened, Captain? Lost the lower unit. You lost it? I lost it. It's still there, but it's no good. Oh, man. Did you hit something? No, it just wore out. Wore out? Well, you're in good hands, though. Damn. That sucks. That's a local captain here, guys. He's gonna have to be scrambling now for parts when, when there's not many. There's not many parts right now. Oh, the shot killing happens. It, it's always a good day. <laughs> wow. Damn. That sucks. So, I should do a kind of video with Rodolfo showing how Rodolfo could uh, restore a lower unit when that happens. I'll tell you what, I mean, I don't know who he uses, but I'm sure being a commercial guy, he's going to have his own network of people and stuff. But uh, yeah, every time you, you, you're down on the water and you're working, that sucks. I wonder if he's going to try to get a backup boat to finish up picking up, uh, up his traps. Some more bo boats are coming in. Damn, it's early in the morning too, man. Freedom Boat Club over here, people, that are members, leaving out of Blackpool Marina. Those of you guys that are members, you guys uh, have uh, freedom over here. Oh boy, what is going on? Oh, do we have somebody else getting towed in? Oh boy, Ostamas. Oh man. Yup. Damn, it's one of those mornings, my friend. Oh man, and I got the wrong lens right now. I definitely got the wrong lens right now, guys. Damn it. All right, so let me see. Let me show you what's going on. He just brought in commercial captain. These guys are going to help these guys. And, uh, oh, my goodness. Oh boy, oh man, there goes the Chicho. There goes the Chicho, everybody is running. Everybody is running. And I, Alfred, oh, the boom! <laughs> Chicho in the house, but Freedom Boat Club runs in for the save, the hurdle of all hurdles. And uh, we continue, guys. This is why, this is why, this is why this guy is gonna be laughing his ass off and say, this is all you had to do is just call me, 2300030. And now, now, you are a victim of the Chicho. But let me tell you something. We have um, track and field superstar. Did you see the hurdle? He jumped over two bowels and uh, saved that Freedom Boat Club. They, they should have called you. They, yeah, they should have called you. <laughs> oh my goodness, my friends. I'm telling you guys, it's worth the 200 bucks. It's worth it. Oh man, and I had my zoom lens on. Fudge. Oh my goodness, guys. Within the murder hornet family. We have, why is this guy taking this island with him? Hold on a second. Within the murder hornet family, and for those of you guys that don't know, the murder hornets are the people who are on jet skis. There is what we call chamos. And uh, chamos are on these bikes. I know guys. Some of them are not technically known as chamos, but we all call them chamos. It's a, it's a Venezuelan no, slang name. They always say the word chamo. Chamo, 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 chamo. So, you know, you guys, I know some of you guys think that we're all Mexican. 
but we're not. So, you know, Venezuelans speak a certain way, Colombians speak a certain way, you know, Puerto Ricans speak a certain way, Cubans speak another way. So the, it's, the slang is different, right? And they use their own terms, right? And chamo is a term that they use often. Like, uh, like uh, Cubans will say, oye, like, hey, you know, they'll use that a lot. And then some people that are American down here in Miami will be like, yo, what's up with the oyes? And they're basically talking about Cubans. So it's, it's hard to understand. And some of you guys are like, how do you know what nationality is what? Like we can kind of look at somebody just by their appearance and, uh, and, their, and with the way they speak and we can tell where they're from, you know? Normally, sometimes if we're like maybe somebody from Venezuela might be similar looking to someone from Costa Rica or Nicaragua, we would just tell them to, we'll talk to them in Spanish and then we can get an idea of what or where they're from, right? And you, you sometimes miss, right? Because sometimes those people hang out with people that are from a certain area and they kind of talk like that. Um, I have friends that are Cuban that speak more American than someone from Tennessee. And that is your history lesson of the day, my friends. So yeah, it's a, it's a, I, it's one of these concepts that people don't realize that they don't know, you know? It's like, until you travel and go to certain places and you're there long enough to understand the reality of not, not just the things that you're taught to be told, right? When you go somewhere, you're like, oh man, you know, Miami isn't like I thought it was. Kind of like it happens when you actually move around, guys. If you don't move around in the world, you, you won't know how or what really happens.